will uh, ask a number of questions, then you can answer all of them together. And maybe I could also pick up from where one of our Milenga has left. And I thank you for your presentation. And I particularly like your idea of incorporating and entrenching national values into the school curriculums from an early age. And uh, the inclusivity you speak about in Mandeleo. But we have also seen a clamor for what would, in some quarters, look like ethnic based counties and constituencies in view of your proposal on inclusivity and entrenching national values in our school curricula. And also the fact that our children, many of our children now are not very attached as their parents are to their ethnicities. What you, would your view be in the establishment of those counties and constituencies that are more ethnic based than anything? Then uh, on uh, the electoral reforms, I think Honorable uh, Catherine has asked, maybe just to reinforce, would you prefer a selection panel mode of getting to reconstitute the IEBC commission or more of a political class-driven uh, appointment process to reconstitute that uh, selections panel? And on the audit of elections, you propose that audit of the elections to be carried out within two to three months after inauguration for the country to move on. Do you mean an audit of the election results or an audit of the electoral processes? That seems, must be all. that seems to be all, please. Just answer in less than three minutes. Yeah. Sorry, thank you on the questions. On political parties, uh, my sister, my and Leo is national, and you have heard the numbers. Yeah. And I see, as I sit here, our members are drawn basically from 47 counties. It's half and half. We are very careful in some pronouncements. If I come in camera, we can share with you. Allow me not to get deeper into that. We would not want the women to be more divided than we have been. We called for dialogue. We are old mothers. The people you see here are not young apart from these girls. Allow me not to go there, please. Thank but you, in thank camera, you. I can come in. The audit 2022, I was also uh, quite clear about that. We left the current 2022 to the leadership here his Excellency the President and Prime Minister. Allow us not to go deeper into that because, as I have said, the reasons are very clear. Um, national majority leaders talked about liking the values and the kids and the now counties which are more ethnic based. I think we would be asking for you to agree with us. The details we can mwishmiwa work on them. We can produce you a paper in the next 24 hours, giving you the way we look at it, the details, because all those 47 counties have our members right to the ward. We have heard their voices, and most of these women are in church, are in most, so if you allow us, we can present you a paper within the next 24 hours, and that will tell you, uh, will give you an answer. On the selection panel, the mode, what we did not say was deliberate. It's not that we had not read the question. <laughs> Allow us not to go there. Allow us not to go there. Here we want one country. When I see my brother there, Eugene Wamalwa, and I remember the journey is one nation, and we are here to tell you we must move forward, God giving us grace as a nation. My sister, where I have not gone deep, I can give you a confidential letter. I used to be a government civil servant, a secretary. I can provide you a confidential letter. <laughs> Thank you very much. Thank you. Before, okay, we shall now excuse you. Before we wind up, yes. there is a call from the lady from Mombasa. We have something to say off cuff, and allow her just to say it. She has come all the way from Lamu, and the other leaders will uh, have to Mimi nitakuwa as brief as possible. Kwanza natoa shukrani kwa serikali yetu vile imetufanyia alamu, nasikia alamu, nasikia 